Hey everybody, my name is Don Gately. I'm the middle school principal in Jericho, New York, which is a small suburb of uh, Long Island. I don't know if you know where Long Island is. It's in New York. <laughs> um, I'm really pleased to be part of this Vox group of middle level leaders, as I'm sure that Steve and Brenda have told you about all of the benefits that they've accrued personally and professionally from their participation in the group. And I just wanted to share with you some of the things that I do as a connected educator that um, I think help move our school forward and help us to innovate and help me to connect in ways that I wouldn't be able to without some of these 21st century tools. One of the things I do in my school is we have uh, monthly uh, lunch and learns for our teachers at which people come together and uh, learn about new tech tools. So that's really a great way for people in an informal setting to get used to uh, sharing ideas. I'm also the co-founder of EdCamp Long Island, and I don't know whether um, Brenda and Steve have spoken to you about EdCamps yet, but that is really a fantastic participant-driven, uh, teacher-chosen cho teacher um, professional development that takes place. Uh, generally, they're held on Saturdays. And we had our first Ed Camp Long Island two years ago, and we drew about 150 people. This year, we grew to 350 people, and we're already planning our next one for October. And that has just been a fantastic way to activate teacher voice in their professional uh, development. I use Voxer uh, also to give teachers feedback on my informal observations, and Brenda and Steve could show you how to do that, but it's a really neat um, vehicle for doing that because we can write teachers emails, we can uh, send them a short note, maybe even a handwritten note, but with Voxer, they get that tone of voice and that, um, that human element that I think is uh, really important in gaining trust and uh, helping teachers to grow. Um, I've used a lot of connected tools at my faculty meetings where, wherein I have my faculty break out into uh, groups and either using Google Forms or, uh, or Google Docs where we populate with uh, ideas to uh, build a shared understanding of important concepts. For instance, right now we're working on a major response to intervention initiative with our middle school staff in which we're creating uh, case studies of uh, intervention resistant students and having stu having teachers work in groups of three on a common um, Google Doc, which we're going to be using to create a middle school uh, response to intervention handbook of um, approaches that work for those kids. We also do a lot of videoing here as well. We had a, uh, 20, a um, full day um, of personal best day of poetry in which students and staff uh, read poems throughout the day. So uh, students would call their mom and say, hey mom, I'm gonna be on the feed at 11 o'clock, tune into the link. And we, we pushed the link out to everyone in the community. And that was a really cool way for parents to see a piece of what happens in the school. Another cool app that we use here is Periscope in which we push out a lot of the uh, classroom activities and lunchroom and recess and hallway activities that the kids enjoy during the day. And we also have um, used Periscope to push out uh, many of our important parent, parent presentations like our orientations, our transition meetings for uh, parents from one grade to the next. And I think the parents really appreciate those opportunities to see those videos live or when we archive those onto our school site. Um, I guess just I want to uh, encourage everyone to get into um, the Connected Educator community because there's just no other better means to increase your uh, relevancy, your ability to collaborate and connect. And for me, the most important thing is I'm surrounded by all of these awesome school leaders and it pushes my own expectations for myself. I just can't get up in the morning and come to work and be ordinary anymore. I really, I find myself aspiring to be as awesome as the people that I'm surrounded with. And those people happen to be uh, all over the country. So thanks very much uh, for giving me this opportunity um, to talk about my experiences and uh, enjoy the rest of the conference.